George kicks off, down to Danny. Danny takes it down the wing. He takes it down, takes on another one. He plays it across, and it's Richard Rabbit. Go! Susie Sheep kicks off, plays the ball back to Pepper. Pepper shoots, and it's a goal. Oh, and it's a goal. Susie scores! Hey, hey, Susie scores! Penny Polar Bear is taking on George. Penny Polar Bear, Penny Polar Bear, can she score? Oh, she does! Penny Polar Bear! Yay! We won! Hooray! Penny Polar Bear scores the winner! After that game of football, it takes us into our next story. Pepper plays football. It is a sunny day and Pepper and Susie Sheep are playing tennis. To you Susie, cheers Pepper, hitting the ball. Now it's Susie's turn. To you Pepper, she cries, hitting the ball straight over Pepper's head. Oh dear. Wah! George feels a, a little bit left out. Sorry George, says Pepper, you can't play tennis, we only have two rackets. George can be the ball boy, cheers Susie. Being a ball boy is a very important job, George, says Pepper. Pepper and Susie are having lots of fun, but they keep missing the ball. Ball boy, they shout together. Huff, puff, George is not having fun. He keeps running to get the ball and he is very tired. Hello everyone, cries Pepper when her friends arrive. We're playing tennis. Can we play too, asks Danny Dog. There aren't enough rackets, replies Susie. Let's play football then, says Danny. Football, hooray, everyone cheers. We can play girls against boys, says Pepper. Each team needs a goalkeeper, says Danny. Me, me, shouts Pedro Pony. Me, me, cries Rebecca Rabbit. Pedro and Rebecca decide to be the goalkeepers. The boys team will start, says Danny. Richard Rabbit gets the ball and runs very fast, right by Pepper, Susie and Candy Cat and straight to the... Goal! cried Danny and Pedro together as Richard kicks the ball straight past Rebecca and into the net. The boy is a winner, cheers Danny. That's not fair. We weren't ready, minds Pepper. George kicks the balls to Richard Rabbit. Richard Rabbit gets the ball. His first one, he's running really fast. And then another one, and he scores! Pepper. Richard. Rebecca picks up the ball and runs. Hey, shouts Danny. That's cheating. You can't hold the ball. Yes, I can, says Rebecca. I'm the goalkeeper. Rebecca throws the ball into the goal, straight past Pedro. Goal, she cries. Rebecca Rabbit kicks off the game. She picks the ball up and she's running. She's running past the ball as she throws it in. Rebecca scores. That goal is not allowed, says Pedro. Yes, it is, says Pepper. No, it isn't, barks Danny. What a load of noise, says Daddy Pig. I'll be the referee. The next team to get a goal will win the game. Daddy Pigs came in. Right, it's last goal wins. Last team to score will win the game. Richard and George run off with the football while everyone is still talking. Where's the ball? asks Pepper. But it's too late. Richard kicks the ball straight into the goal, past Pedro. Hooray! The boys win, cries Danny. Football is a silly game, sighs Pepper, disappointed. Just a moment, says Daddy Pig. The boys scored in their own goal. That means the girls win. Really? gasp all the girls. Hooray! Football is a great game, cheers Pepper. Everyone laughs. Ha ha ha. The end. Thank you for watching. Till next time.